Hey, what's going on everybody? Scudder Gaming here, thank you very much for joining us. Uh, we're back, it's a new patron vlog, um, it's been a couple of weeks since I've done one of these. Uh, and the point of these obviously is just to keep you guys up to date with the channel. Uh, the way it works is that you can see these first on the patron site, um, and then they get released on YouTube. So if you want to see these first, they come out on about the 20th and about the 5th of each month. So uh, so set that in your, in your calendars um, and, uh, and go and check it out, that way you can have, uh, have your say with the channel really, that's what these are about. Um, so I thought I'd, I'd, I'd quickly cover off some bits and pieces about the channel, some of the things you may see, some things that are coming up. Um, so first off, collabs. I mentioned them a couple of weeks ago. Uh, collabs, I'm really pushing those. Uh, you will have hopefully caught some of the tabletop sim stuff we've done, lots of snake oil. Um, there's some fun employment coming. Uh, sorry, fun employed. There's lots of other games that, I'm, uh, that we're bringing. So hopefully you guys, if you enjoyed the snake oil, you'll like these. Uh, and hopefully there's more to come. So I hope, you, uh, I hope you're enjoying those. If you haven't seen them, go and check them out. Um, all of the guys that I record with, I'll put all of their links in the, uh, in the description below. So you can check those out as well. But um, yeah, please check those out. Let me know what you think. If you want to see more of them, if you don't want to see any more of them, then let me know uh, and we'll go from there. Um, next up is live streams. I did my first live stream in forever, basically. Um, Apart from maybe the Hitman one, which I did quite recently, but that was really just to bring that first level. Um, so I, I got my hands on a copy of Ori in the Blind Forest, um, game that I'd heard huge amounts about, but never actually played myself, um, and started playing that yesterday. So today's the 17th. I did it on the, on the Saturday night, um, and I think I'm, I'm going to try and arrange regular streams of that game to begin with. Um, I'm not sure how well it lends itself to streaming, actually, if I'm really honest, but it's a good game. It's a beautiful game. Uh, you'll be able to see the highlights of that on, on YouTube fairly soon. Uh, but uh, just uh, if you, yeah, keep an eye out on the social media. I'll do my best to let you know when I'm going to be um, when I'm going to be streaming, and hopefully we can see you guys there. Um, next up, Prison Architect. That's been going for a little while. Uh, I need to record some more. Um, just to let you know that there's a little lull in, in releasing those videos just because I haven't got any more pre-recorded but uh, I'm going to sit down and do a batch session probably today I think to try and get uh, to get a load recorded we're heading towards death row so fingers crossed we can get to that although uh, if you haven't seen it already look out for the uh, the escape attempt uh, RimWorld I've got huge amounts of RimWorld pre-recorded um, that haven't been released yet uh, and now Alpha 14 is out so they're behind the curve of, of those releases so I'm, I'm guessing I'll probably leave those releasing fairly slowly but maybe we'll focus on smaller chunks of RimWorld uh, because you can now set up scenarios so um, I'm going to try and think of something clever to do with, with that for Alpha 14 um, who knows if I'll be able to do that or not but that's where we're coming from uh, Democracy 3 Africa um, I did a very short let's play of that um, you guys seem to have really enjoyed it um, so I think I'm going to, to give that another go and maybe we'll go to the usual democracy just the uh, just the uh, you know the UK uh, USA equivalent of, of the African one um, and give that a go I know there's a new uh, release electione electioneering uh, that's come out um, so maybe we'll have a look at that let me know what you think on that and let us, let us know uh, and obviously football manager that's still happening um, we're still plowing on with football manager um, if you haven't checked that out please do it's got a huge amount of content um, and uh, one of my favorite series uh, games that I'm potentially thinking about playing so Red Dead Redemption has uh, now become backwards compatible on Xbox one um, let me know if you want to see it it apparently looks really good it's a fantastic game I played it the first time around amazing game um, basically uh, it's um, GTA in the Wild West if you haven't ever seen it um, I'm sure you will have done if you want to see me play that through then please let me know um, next up is The Division. I've got my hands on a copy of The Division um, and I'm tempted to, to give it a go. Um, who knows? If you want to see that, let me know. I'd like to do it with a group. So um, you know, if, um, if you want to see that, then please let me know. Um, channel update. We're on 852 subscribers. Um, need to keep pushing on. We're just over halfway through the year. Still got a long way to go to get to that 1,000 mark. Uh, a couple of months ago, uh, a couple of weeks ago, I said uh, we, were, we were pushing on and doing okay. Um, and then YouTube had a bit of a purge and got rid of lots of old, um, lots of old subscribers who um, who weren't um, who weren't genuine. I guess I don't quite know where they've come from, but either way, they've they've gone. Um, so we're now back down to eight five two from about eight sixty. So you know it is what it is. I'd rather that that subscribers were active and, and engaging in the community. So uh, if you are a subscriber and you're watching this you want to know anything just leave a comment and I'll do my best to come back to you let me know what you think let me know what you want to see more of less of all the rest of that stuff and we'll go from there 
Um, so that's kind of where we are with the channel. We just need to keep plowing on. Live streams I'm going to start doing. Um, I know I say every video, but we've started yesterday. We're going to keep doing them. Um, other thing I wanted to touch on is just a couple of things that have happened, uh, not necessarily in my life, but in, in the real world. Um, I thought I'd just I'd, I'd draw some attention to. So obviously um, the Euros finished. Uh, congratulations to Portugal. Not entirely sure they deserved it. Disappointed a little bit for France and after everything that's been going on there. It would have been really good for them to, to you know, as a, as a country pull together. And I think it did that anyway. So it's good that football can do that. Um, and then obviously a couple of days later, there's another terrorist incident. I think it's a terrorist incident anyway, uh, involving the lorry, which um, I'm just not draw too much attention to, but was, you know, was disgraceful to hear really. Um, so that's disappointing. Um, but Euros, I thought they were really good. Football quality and the, you know, the big players at that, and especially England, a uh, bit of a letdown, but I thought, you know, the, the, the tournament was exciting enough um, and to experience some of it in Germany when Germany were doing so well and beating Italy, that was that was really good. Um, the other thing that's happened that hasn't really involved me too much, but I feel obliged to mention it, Pokemon Go. Um, what is that all about? I mean, I, to be honest, Pokemon kind of, I kind of skipped the whole Pokemon thing. I was, I was playing computer games at that point in time, but um, I kind of, it kind of bypassed me. I never really got into it. I remember buying or having Pokemon on the original Game Boy, that's how old I am, and um, and just playing for like 20 minutes and thinking, you know what, this isn't for me. Um, and it kind of, but from there it bypassed me. And now, 20 years on, um, it's out and it, it's everywhere. It's insane. It's a really good idea. I'm surprised more people haven't done it sooner. I think it's been tried before. Um, I think it's going to be the start of huge amount of games similar to this, which is interesting. Um, it concerns me a little bit that um, you know, kids are going to be out going to places that maybe they wouldn't necessarily visit if they uh, they uh, if they didn't have a, an app on their phone. Um, and by all accounts, there's people being mugged and various other things. So, you know, I think there's a there's a serious case for um, being sued in terms of Nintendo and and um, the guys who are making that game. If if things are going to happen like that, I know it warns you to be careful, but I think there's you know there's there's a lawsuit around the corner would be my suggestion. Um, that being said, you know Nintendo. I I was sure that Nintendo were down there down the pan to be honest I didn't think there was any coming back from the situation that they'd got themselves in uh, through releasing a lack of, of proper hardware um, you know and the, the hardware they're kind of going for gimmicks rather than just being flat out and going for a gaming console which is what Nintendo used to be um, so I thought their time was up but um, I think the share prices have skyrocketed so good good for them I'm pleased I'm pleased that they're not going because actually a lot of my gaming history was with Nintendo, certainly Mario, um, Zelda, all the rest of those games that everybody else played. That's kind of where I came from. So, um, you know, I'm pleased it's not the end of the end of the road for them. Um, I'm pleased that this looks like it should save save them. But um, you know, I think there's uh, some concerns. And you know, I'm a massive geek. I'm a massive geek, and I said this at work. I am a massive geek. Um, but there's lots of people having conversations about Pokemon, and I can't be involved because I don't know what any of them are. I love a good pun and I can't think of any because I don't know what any Pokemon's names are. Um, so I'm devastated by that. So I'm tempted to do some research. But um, I'm just, yeah, I'm pleased that, that there's something out there. It's good that it gets people out of the house. Uh, it's bad that it gets people out of the house and allows other people to know where they're going. Um, you know, and it, it won't be long before we see a seven year old walking around a crack den, you know, because that's where a landmark is. So let's just, let's just, everybody who's got it, just make sure you're aware of your surroundings and what you're doing and where you're going and, and go there with someone else if you if you can so um you know I'm, I'm i'm intrigued by the whole thing i don't think i'll be downloading it it seems like a lot of hard work to me um you know and i was watching someone play it the other day even though it's not available in the uk it wasn't available in the uk earlier um, i saw someone playing it and bloody hell it looks hard to hit those things with those stupid pokeballs um so that's that's kind of where i'm coming from um, this was just a real quick update. Uh, check out the merchandise. Um, actually had a sale of a shirt, which might not sound like a lot. I know that sounds ridiculous, in fact. Um, but I, I did the merchandise thing just because I had I had a um, I had an urge to be creative, and I thought, you know what, why not? Um, so I did the merchandise thing. Didn't really expect anything to happen. Someone brought a T-shirt yesterday or the other day. I'm really quite pleased about it. That you know, it, it feels really weird to me. I was talking to um, talking to the guys that we do the collabs with, and I was saying. What I find really weird is I have no idea who could have that. So I could be walking down the road and the one person who's bought a t-shirt 
could be walking past me, um, which would be really weird. But that being said, my my logo is a Scotty dog. It's probably just a grandma um, who's got a, a Scotty dog infatuation. So you never know. Um, nothing wrong with a bit of cougar. Um, so that's kind of where I'm coming from. I just wanted to bring this update. Uh, check out the YouTube channel. Check out the streams. Keep an eye on you on Twitter because that's where I'll announce that I'm streaming early. Um, keep an eye on those things. Uh, I hope you're enjoying the, the stuff that we're putting out. Please let me know in the comments. If you're not enjoying the collabs, let me know and we'll, we'll cut back on them. I've been doing quite a lot of them and it's meant that some of the other stuff, like Prison Architect, has taken a back seat. So if you're not enjoying those things, please let me know and I'll make sure I get the um, the the right things done at the right time for you guys because that's what this is about. Um, but anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter at Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you.